what he has to say. I've been in the House for two weeks and I have noted the courage and efficiency of my colleagues in the House have been showing in taking the mask off this government, which is secret, a secretive and very ideological. Government, and I want to thank my colleagues of the House and the Senate to have shown that to Canadians. I have seen it by my, with my eyes in the last two weeks. Answer. Yes, uh, we have a very right-wing government uh, which is incapable of implementing its policies to the extent it would like to. Uh, this government is very frustrated that it can't get the House to go along with it, so there may be elections, and I'm saying, I've said, and I repeat, I don't want to rush Canadians into an election. That's not what I want, but my duty is to make sure that my party will be ready for elections. Secretive government, indeed. We know this is an ideological and neoconservative government. Canadians, and I plan to make sure that Canadians know the difference between the conservative approach to champion a narrow ideological agenda that plays to their socially conservative base and our and it's they, what they are doing today, it's only as a minority government. Imagine what they would do as a majority uh, government. I want to thank again all my colleagues who have help, been so helpful to unmask this very ideological government and secretive government. We have a government, as I said, that is so at odds with Canadians, so frustrated to not be able to implement his very right-wing agenda.